Okay, I have a question. This is something that I actually have been thinking about. Is lately there's so much focus on women, like, and I think that's really fabulous. There's like the, all sorts of assemblage and forums and things that we've all been going for a long time. It's just it's an interesting time, I think, for us. And someone you're like, oh, the woman winemaker, right? Can't yeah. I just be a winemaker? Yeah, we've been doing it. It's we're women and we're winemakers, or we're winemakers and we're mothers, and we're winemakers and we're this. And I mean, as speaks to multiple industries, you can be multiple things and still do it, which is great. We also are in Oregon, which is an amazing industry full of women that are part of it, where Jess was having a interview with an intern the other day and she was German. And Jess was like, yeah, so we have a all woman team, you know, and the girl was just like blown away by that and just couldn't believe that there would be a place that would have that. I think other people anywhere else would look at us and go, wow, that's so lucky you get to be with these amazing women every day that are just like special. I think like yes in Oregon there's so many women winemakers already. I think there's a higher percentage of women winemakers here than anywhere. There's movement yeah, and I think there's more women entering the wine industry which is great. I mean I have three women to look up to right here sitting here so that's something to look forward to that I feel like I can count on at Stoller. Just having a, a place where it's a little bit more accepting to have a family and being a woman. It's inspiring to have these different personalities to work with and it's unique, that's for sure. I really feel like this is a unique company and this, this whole thing I mean, is or, it's or, it's truly organic. I think we have an awesome opportunity right now and I think we're all lucky to be part of that. Yes.